Oh, there's something here, all right. Big ass brown. Big ass brown. Yep. It's close. Hold on to that. Yeah, he's gonna be close. He was, uh, check that out. Never, Never get getting home. away, even on a 10. That's a Let's nice get a measure on him first while we get him here. Ooh, he's gonna throw a shit fit. He's not quite 20. 18. 18. That's a fat 18, though. That looks Oh, stop it, dude. <laughs> He's growling, folks. This lure is going to be toast. Gonna mangle the hook. Thing's got too much jaw. Going the wrong way. Am I? On that other hook, yeah. Oh. All right, folks, so not quite a 20, but this fish is fat. He's easily a three pound brown. He feels good. Look at the belly on that male. That is a fatty. And the kipe. What a beautiful fish. Yeah, get that sucker back in the water already. Make sure that he looks like he's okay. He's good. <laughs> Yes, so now we can do a release here and send him back to the wild. And that's on a six. Yes. So, we've been changing sizes uh, in anticipation of brook trout today, but this guy hit a number six and he definitely, actually I don't think he did bend the hook, but he was completely stuck in both, both jaws, jaws in the corner of the mouth. He was never, he was never going to be off. That's crazy too, that fish right through that hole. I let it drop. I was just t tugging it, you know, like reeling so slow. Awesome. That's probably the king of that hole there, huh? Here. Hey buddy. How you doing, good doggy? Hey, buddy. Hey, good guy. How you doing, buddy? How's it going? You're such a good doggy. There's a guy just ticking at it. There's a fish. Oh, he got off, damn it. Nice and tight. So we got biters. The question is, how much? There's a fish. It's fully uh, charged up. Just a little brown. Get my hand wet here. Probably 12 inch brown, he's pretty beat up. Oh, and there's a nice one too. It's a little better fish. 
Yeah, about the same. This guy's a little greener. Yeah, about the same size. This the guy's in a little better shape. Hit like a ton of bricks. And these fish can be super freaking spooky right here. Came one. Shit. There came a couple of biters. There's a fish finally. Oh, and he got off. Another small brown. What's going on here? And it's plenty sharp. Fish that hit. It's a hard hit. Just a little guy. Just a little guy. Not exactly what I'm looking for, but he's pretty. Another fish. A little brown. So I think they are liking the gold better. Another little girl, little guy. Just a little seven, eight inch, maybe nine incher. Little guy. Little orange and green, brown, brown. Just a little guy. That's what we've seen here today. He's a little thicker than the other ones. Is the nicest brown of the day. Yeah, I think that's the best one I've had. It's a solid footer. Pretty green fish. a nice fish. Pretty brown. Boy, and he got off. Jesus, they are psycho. Oh, and there was another bite. There he is. terribly dirty here. There's a nice fish, about 11, 10. There's another little guy. Just a little brown. A little 
little guy, about six inches. Ah, he was very lightly hooked. All right. I've seen enough of this nonsense. <sighs> Takes a little more than a six inch fish to get me uh, feeling super excited, but I suppose it's better than a skunk. There's a biter. Oh, and he got off. Damn it. There's a nicer fish. He's off too. So, uh, ending a, a pretty good week of fishing. Um, all small browns today. Lost a couple of nicer ones here, but not anything more than 14 or 15. The bite uh, was pretty good though. I mean, I don't know how many fish that was, 20 in a couple hours. Um, but keep watching. I've got some steelhead stuff coming the end of the uh, month here. and. Uh, Thanks for watching. Happy fishing from Wisconsin Trout Fishing.